Jesus Christ! What the hell? By the time you got here, oh, I got here as quick as I could. Are you all right? Oh! Why? When did you last get some sleep? Ah, uh, depends. What time is it? A quarter to eleven. Ah, uh, she's dead. Come in, come in. I got something to show you. Close your eyes. Oh wait, I have a off. Uh, you have to close your eyes. Don't close your eyes. Okay, you ready? Feast your eyes on this. Congratulations. You've invented an empty room. Stand here. One moment. Now, what time is it? I told you, it's a quarter to 11. No, 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 exactly. It's 10.48. Now, count down the last five seconds until 10.49. Sure. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> What? What the hell is that? It was a soccer ball. This soccer ball, to be precise. You see, at some point later today, I'm going to throw this ball into that machine to prove to you that I have a functioning time machine. A time machine? Uh-huh. How many cans of Red Bull have you drunk this morning? Seventeen. Yeah. You need to get some sleep, mate. I can't sleep now. No, seriously, I can't sleep. I don't think I, I've been blinked in the last three hours. Anyway, why are we talking about sleep? Are you hearing what I'm telling you? I've invented a time machine. You're serious? Why in God's name would you invent a time machine? You speak of solar and night, but just what is it? Hey, Norris. Mm. You know that whole grandfather paradox thing? What, go back in time and kill your grandfather? It creates an infinite loop in the space-time continuum. Yeah. I don't think that would work. I bet you 50 bucks. You invented a time machine just to win a bet. 50 bucks is 50 bucks. Here, put this on. Why? I'm sending you back in time to kill your grandfather. What? Why me? I built the machine, I can't do everything. But why are we killing my grandfather? Because I like my grandfather. But what if I like my grandfather? Dude, I've met your grandfather. The guy's a cunt. OK, Norris, are we ready to do this? Actually, Chuck, I think I'd rather... Initializing time displacement in five, four, three, two... Wait a minute. Is this gonna hurt? That never even occurred to me. Time travel hurts. Good to know. What happened to you? Some guy attacked me. Beat the shit out of me before I managed to give him the slip. Son of a bitch didn't even say why. You think it's because you're French? I'm not French. No? You kind of look French. How do I look French? I'm not French. So, did you get it done? Yeah. Yeah, it's done. Tough thing to do? Oh, God, no. Guy was even more of an asshole when he was young. Made it pretty easy on me. Good. Now, if the theory is real, you should start vanishing from existence right about... What do you about... mean, vanishing? Now. That was pretty anticlimactic. Hang on. Hang 
on a sec. You should have disappeared, but you didn't. So I win. So pay up. This is the most elaborate bet I've ever lost. But if he doesn't exist anymore, then no one would have gone back to kill his grandfather, which would mean that his grandfather would still be alive, which would mean that If you're back, then you could have gone back and killed your grandfather. So that means... It's gonna be a long day. Oh, good. It worked. What happened? Well, I had to go back in time and uh, fix the time loop. You went back and stopped me from killing my grandfather. Well, I tried, but uh, you got away from me. What you wind up doing? I had sex with your grandmother. Oh. Ew. So hopefully, that's the end of all that. Oh, wait a minute. Do you think there's going to be any side effects from this? No. <laughs> <laughs>